Okay, you guys, we're at Shereen's house. We're looking at replacing this unit. Uh, currently, it's a five ton. Uh, it's like newer pad. The insulation isn't really that old. <clears throat> at least the air conditioner side of it isn't that old. We're gonna replace in this, uh, level up the pad, may go back to the new pad. And then line set travels up. Uh, it goes from here, goes all the way up through the side of the home. Um, we're looking at possibly getting some new insulation on this. Um, brought down and then coming into the unit. Okay guys, looking at a unit in the attic, kind of start with the return. Uh, this will remain the same. More than likely run a new piece of flex up into uh, a box that will fabricate. <clears throat> and then new air handler. This is actually 115 volt, there's no heat. There's a, a boiler for heat. And then we got the supply on them right here. We got a 14 inch tap coming off and hitting um, duct work around this area and then another 14 inch coming off on that side and duck work running down that area i believe it does both floors i'll double check with her to see on that um the line set can just be flushed the actual drain here runs out with that as well um, so i'm gonna put this on a pump uh just to be safe so i'll make that pan even bigger uh we got plenty of room to work with there I don't know if that's draining properly. There's a lot of turns and twists. Um, so I think we can just reuse that, but just put it on a pump. <clears throat> and then uh, here's our electric and new safety pan, new safety switch. That's pretty much it. Attic access is a pool downstairs already. I'll measure that out, make sure we can get everything up and through there. Oh, the other thing is we got an old furnace up here. <clears throat> so I'm gonna look at getting this furnace out as well. <clears throat> 